morning everyone welcome to daily post india this is jasmine kaur and here are the top 5 morning stories vice presidential election when kayan idu gopal krishna gandhi contest today the winner of the polls will be appointed as the ex officer chairman of the rajya sabha according to the election commission officials the voting will be begin on friday today at 10 am and will carry on till 5 pm the counting of the votes will start at 7 pm and the result will be declared today evening The preparations for the removal of IAS officer Kahan Singh Pannu who was appointed 2 months ago by the CM Captain Amrinder Singh as the chairman of the Punjab Pollution Control Board is set to be removed from the post of chairman on Friday. Traders demanded the immediate removal of the Pannu on the issue of corruption while discussing a new industrial policy from the CM here CM assured the removal him on the spot. The Gangotri Highway near Ladrang and Chhadate was closed on Saturday after rain triggered landslides in the Uttarakhand. Torrential rain for the past few days was wreaked havoc in the state with the reports of five persons death on Friday while the Dehradun district four people were injured after a house in Vikasnagar collapsed to falling heavy showers on Thursday. A national level women hockey player found it dead on the railway tracks in Haryana Rewari the GRP said today Jyoti Gupta national level women hockey player rising 20 year old hockey star and a national level player was found it dead on the railway tracks on the Wednesday evening as such a government railway police Rewari Ranveer Singh said he said Jyoti Gupta hailed from Vijayanagar in Sonipat Mumbai Khalsa appreciate Swami bringing resolution to Sikh genocide president of Damdami Taksal Sant Gyani Hanam Singh Khalsa presented a record of military attacks on the Shri Darbar Sahib in June 1984 to BJP senior leader MP Dr Subramanian Swami thanked them for the bringing resolution in the Rajya Sabha by MLA of Damdami Taksal who arrived in Mumbai to attend a function Anta Thakur gave him warm welcome on this occasion he discussed his serious thoughts about Sikh affairs For more such updates you can visit our Facebook page Daily Post India you can also visit our website www.dailypost.in you can also subscribe to our YouTube channel on, and for frequent and amateur updates don't forget to download our app Daily Post India thank you